We're gonna fight it off of fire. I think we produce these swarms. I'm 90% sure I'm shitting mosquitoes at this point. What is going on, Nerf Paraders and Ark Survival Evolved fans? Welcome back here to the Genesis Simulation, where we're virtualing our reality and hanging out with our pals and our patrons of the Nerf Break community. We got Craze here, we got Snipe here. Tiger is running around like a head with his chicken cut off because he's died somewhere in the bog. LOL, because this is supposed to be the easy zone. And Ellis is attempting to join, and Rambate is standing in the corner because he's AFK. I am Nick. This is our friend, guys. Welcome to the channel, and thank you so much for coming to hang with us. As we progress, Tiger has died again. It's a meme. The meme is real. We are going to do some building here today. We've got some things planned. So, first things first, I have reached the tier of not having to be in my underwear. I refuse to wear pants until it's flak pants. So we're going to go to armor, we're going to go to metal, and we're going to finally make a suit of flak for us. This feels good. We've got grapples. We just need, or we got crossbow. We just need a couple more grapple hooks. And we're running low on the paste. We've had to hand make the paste with the chitin and the keratin and the hexagons. And we're going to try to see if we can't solve a little bit of that dilemma here today. We got in comms with us. We got Ellis in comms, even though he's not really here yet. We've got Craze. We've got Rambo, who's maybe here, maybe not. We've got Cypher. We've got Tiger. Everybody's here. And if you guys would like to join, check out the link in the description to the Nerd Prey Patreon. Help support the community and oon oon slash earn cool rewards as we go. Uh, dare I take these grapples? Let's see how many we can make, actually. We're going to see how many grapple hooks that we can make. And we're going to try to make all of them. 67. Oh, okay. I'm good with that. I'm going to take these five, and we are going to first look for a frog, second maybe buy paste with hexagons, and we're going to try to make some cliff platforms. The reason why I want to make the cliff platforms is because we are going to work on our Ewok village here in the trees. This is going to be home base for us. The bog is going to be our home base, and we're going to execute all of our operations from this area. So as we progress from log tier to stone tier, which I do have some in my inventory. We're gonna we're gonna play with that. We need to advance. Now, clothes are gonna be put on. None of this stuff is happening in the appropriate fashion. I am geared and now we can look for a frog. Get back in here. Where are you where are you going? His people need him. My <laughs> my spider! Get back here! Do you see this guy? Oh no the, okay what I Sucky McSuckerson, get back in your ball. Your people don't need you right now. I need you. Holy nuts. All right, we have some Trank darts. I have 27. Uh, that, I thought this through, as you can clearly see. I hope this guy isn't super high level. Would you say it was 50-ish? Wait, did you already knock him out? No. No, I bowled. Oh, you bowled him. Crazy professional. Are you? Would you say that you are Parola with the Vola? Uh, maybe it's good as you. <gasps> Another contender with the Prola of the Bola skills. Well, we're going to use those Prola of oh, skills he's here. Asleep. Is he asleep already? No freaking way. I put three darts in it. Yeah, he's out. That's fantastic. Uh, all right. We're, oh, no. I have to go get meat for a completely unrelated reason. We do we what, have like the Like uh, raw meat? Yeah, I mean, I think, well, Prime would be perfect, but I think we cooked it. Yeah, I got raw meat on me. Yeah, just toss that in there for now. I'm going back to base. I'm going to see if we set, still have some of that raw Prime. We were cooking it in the campfire. If I can find my way back to base here. Uh, it's right under the tree. We should be good. There we go. Uh, it's auto-tame already. <laughs> Is it tamed already? Oh, okay. Well, yeah. Then it appears my struggle was in vain. Returning to you, I, I have Soul Trap on me. We're going to get that guy. Out. Do you, have, you already have a saddle? No. Oh, we can oh, pokeball it. We, we're gonna make one. I'm gonna put. You, did you already pokeball him? I can if you want me. Yeah, to. Yeah, yeah. Go ahead. Go ahead. Good. I um, I was trying to be useful, and apparently my most useful skill is tranking and running away, and also being prolo with bullet. Anyway, <laughs> we're gonna put these grapples back on our. Oh god, I'm getting swarmed. Yeah. We're gonna fight it off a of fire. I think we produce these swarms. I'm 90% sure I'm shitting mosquitoes at this point. How is that bug dude? How is he against the swarms? 
Oh, I, ki killed. I killed it with fire, so apparently not that great. Apparently, All praise the yeah. fire. I Their job is they're supposed to be. Oh, come on, come on, grapple. Their job is supposed supposed to be able to eat bugs. So you would think that they might be superior. But over here in the right. virtual reality simulation that is Genesis, that is maybe not the case. Since fungal wood is clearly much stronger than regular wood, my man Craze here has found us a source of fungal wood right here next to the bog. We are going to get as much of this as we can since we... Oh, God, I'm going to get spit on. I got herpes in my eyes. Help me, Craze. Oh, you... oh my hero. You I, got did... you, I got you. I got you. You're my hero. Uh, we need to make several stone platforms. Ultimately, I think we're going to end up making metal ones. We probably could have saved ourselves a whole hell of a lot of trouble and just made metal ones. But we're starting with stone, damn it. We're progressing as we are supposed to progress, and we have plenty of stone to make our platforms now with our superior and strong grr, fungal wood. I also could have just made a damn grinder with S+, plus and we could have converted it. After much debate, trial and error, and Nick death success beams, we are going to place our very first cliff platform uh, about as flush as I can get with right here. Now I have red. Red is bad. Red is dead. Uh, there. Perfect. It's a little lackluster compared to our base being, you know, right there. But we're going to start from the, ba the the bottom, the ground, and work our way up. What we're going to be doing from this point going forward is making more cliff platforms vertically, branching throughout the forest to various trees, and having an elevator system to get between them. So we don't have to necessarily walk our spider cars all over the Ark Simulation Genesis to try to get from platform to platform. Here, I'm just gonna casually walk up this side. Here, okay, we're gonna walk around. Let's get, no, just, just, just jump in. Just, okay. Now we're gonna take spider car, and we're gonna walk spider car up to the next pretend platform that doesn't really exist, and we're gonna hop down and parachute. Because somebody told me that I can hit control for parachute, and I had no idea that I could do that until it was commented to me. So thank you for that comment, because it's a really cool feature and fun to play with. I'm getting better at driving spider cars. Or did they drive me? I still haven't figured that out. So with our very first cliff platform down, the base is able to be expanded on. We are going for an extremely cool PvE-style build here. And it's mostly... I say mostly. It's mostly going to be open-air kind of design, with the cliff flat platforms playing a major role in it. Mostly open air because swarms are going to be a thing. I do want to test out how, how high swarms will target you. But that's something that we... That's a bridge we can cross in a little bit, you know, maybe later. What I do want to try to do now... I'm just going to dump all my stuff in here. Oh, God, you guys have been getting fiber. Did you, ta did you take out the chickle tech? Oh, wait, it was the Megatherium getting fiber. The Megatherium. Nice. I was going to say, did we did we get a chickle ticket? I think we had one last time. Tiger, you have, yes. might have one Pokeballed. I'm taking this yeah, guy yeah. out. Taking the frog out. We need to test for science if a swarm can be defeated by a frog and produce paste. I see you. Okay, perfect. Perfect. My man Sniper bringing us a swarm for science. Let's see what this does. For the paste, maybe? Ellis was killed. Um, he's gone go. and forgotten. <laughs> I'm such a terrible person. Where, Nobody where, cares for Alice. where is the hitbox here, Ark? Is it actually doing anything? Oh, no, I got, I got it. Beasel killed him. Hide and meat. No paste. So while these are technically virtual reality bugs in the virtual reality swamp, they give no virtual reality paste. That is kind of devastating. I was really hoping that they would. So we are... Oh. oh? Another swarm. Another swarm? <laughs> Another swarm? We can test it again for science. Uh, we're going to have to stick to our... Our swamp cave runs, essentially. I mean, swamp cave run on the island for paste, or uh, stick to farming Titan Amiras. Or using our hexagons to buy them. I want to avoid buying stuff with hexagons, if at all possible. Level 10 swarm, getting hide. Yeah, no, no dice on the sword. God, there they are. They're everywhere down here. We're attracting them with our frog. But I don't think he does extra damage to him either. 
So paste... Paste might be a challenging resource to come upon in the bog. More challenging than I originally expected. So it might be the best course of action... God, they're everywhere. Is to farm the chitin, farm the keratin, and make it with stone? Maybe? Or perhaps we'll discover a swamp cave similar to what we have on the island and make frog runs on it. As we hang out back here at base with our spidery overlords, the tribe has discovered something rather interesting in our quest for cementing paste. Uh, while we haven't been able to gather it from swarms, Tiger was able to discover some dung beetles here on and in the bog. However, not a plentiful source of them. We haven't found a really good spawn of dung beetles, but taking the megatherium... Dung beetle hunting produces quite a bit of chitin, which we have then been able to turn into some cementing paste, which we'll be able to use to make many more platforms to please our spidery overlords. But this is where we're going to leave you for now, Nerd Parade, we're going to progress some more on the Genesis series here. If you're interested in coming to play with us, check out the link in the description to the Patreon. We're playing here on this server, this Let's Play, with our patrons and our friends. And also, if you haven't done so yet, now's a perfect time to join in the Nerd Parade community. The link to the Discord is also there. Anybody and everybody is welcome. And we have all these servers kind of clustered together, so you're welcome to play on the servers with us if you so choose. Like I said, though, this is where I leave you, Nerd Parades. Thank you guys so much for coming. Hey, if you like this video, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so yet. Also, smash that thumbs up button and ring the bell and all the good stuff that goes along with the tubes of Ubery. Take care of yourselves out there. Stay awesome. Remember to pet your spidery overlords on their creepy little heads. And we'll catch you in the next one. Later.